my spoon was saying. Hi, everybody. Hey, a $1 bill smells the same as a $5 bill. Who knew? This channel is all about education. So, I haven't been in a, in a while. I've been trying to get my life on track. Man, had some trouble with my knee. Found out I, the only option is a knee replacement. But that will be for a few years. So, we'll talk about that later. I said I need to see a catalog. I told the doctor, I need to see a catalog, uh, you know, what are my options? Transformer, Terminator, Chuck Norris, I'll take any of those. So, but today I want to talk to you about fitness, being fit, healthy at least, you know, um, Healthy weight, exercise, eating right, and all that, all that bullshit. <laughs> I'm so tired. You know, I never had a problem with my weight uh, until probably about my 30s, my mid to late 30s. And before that, I had always had like laborious jobs where I was working in packing sheds or in restaurants or uh, for myself <laughs> I always was very active and then I got that cushy office job and that cushy went to my tushy and my thighs and worse my belly I got a pot belly man I cannot get rid of the thing uh, a friend of mine on Facebook today NGO shout out to you, on to my number one fan, kitty cat, Catherine. Um, she said, I've lost a lot of things in my life. Uh, I'm paraphrasing, can't remember exactly what she said because I have a horrible memory. Uh, she said, I've lost a lot of things in my life, but there's one thing I can't lose, and that's weight. Man, I know how she feels. You know, uh, when Lucy and I got married back in... 2014 I believe it was we were I was at my highest weight so I know the woman loves me because she married me when I was at my my baddest <laughs> Fat. Um, but I want to talk to you about uh, just better eating healthy um, and I'll and I'll tell you a wake-up call one was my knee uh, the doctor said I have a lot of arthritis in there now, so I really need to strengthen my my muscles in my leg because my knee gives out, and if my leg's not strong, I'm just going to fall on my big fat ass. That's exactly what he said. Just kidding. Um, but I got a wake-up call the other day because I got a call from my shirt. And my shirt said, listen, we got to talk. And I said, okay, what's this all about? I said, just, you know, we'll talk real soon. Let's get together and talk. I said, are you breaking up with me? And said, that's what it sounds like. And uh, no, no, we're just talking. Talk. So I said, well, where do you want to meet? Let's meet right now. Let's talk about this. And his uh, shirt said, well, you know, meet me where we usually hang out. So I go to the living room. And their shirt, you know who else was there? Pants. I said, what's Pants doing here? And uh, shirt said, look. This is an intervention. We need to get you under control. You've been putting a lot of stress on us. Uh, you're stretching us out. We're getting worn thin. You stretched Levi out over there a long time ago and you wore a hole in his behind. And uh, 
I said, well, who else is complaining? Who else is complaining about this? About this? And uh, she said, zipper. And little buttons. Little buttons went to a union rep the other day. <laughs> oh, Sam. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Settle down. We'll get this under control. So, needless to say, when your clothes call you on the telephone and tell you we need to talk, you better listen, you know, because you gotta get that stuff under control. <laughs> so, anyways, that, uh, you know, I, I joke about my, my extra potty. I named, I named my belly potty because we're friends. I thought maybe that would be a better way to go, but you don't want to make friends with Potty. Potty's not that great. But I, I joked around with people saying, you know, this is just my winter coat. Mm -hmm. Well, it's been winter for about four years, Run. Winter is coming. Winter has already come. You need to let it go. So, I'll be riding my bike. I'm um, trying to eat a little bit healthier. We'll see how that goes. See how long I can keep up with it. Um, but I want to hear from you guys. How do you, you know, and I, I want the miracle. I don't want the, you know, eat right and exercise. I want the miracle stuff. I want to just wake up and have a flat belly again. Um, but I want to hear from you guys. I want to, I want to hear how you keep your healthy weight. Um, what you do, do you drink smoothies? You, you know, do you eat cardboard? <laughs> what do you do? I want to know. So, uh, comment in the box below. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I will try and get better about posting more content, uh, a little more consistently let's say so uh call me up you hey i also sell real estate with mavoto and we do real estate photography lucy and i so uh calgary number 018-44773 um so if you need help with real estate give me a call because i love that stuff um, and if, uh, if you have some good tips for me about exercise and whatnot, let me know. I know um, Snickers wanted me to do an ab, ab roller, I think it was ab roller, ab cruncher, something abstract review. <laughs> so let's talk about that, Snicks. Um, and Rosie Kincaid, how about this? Well, that's just life. I guess. All right, everybody. I'll talk to you later. Please subscribe and hit the notification button if you want to hear a bell when I post a new video because what else are you going to do? Talk to you later.